Hey, my friends, there's breaking news out of the golf world. Did you see that over the weekend, Scotty Scheffler has once again won a master's title? He has become the undisputed number one golfer on earth. In fact, uh, the media are going to tell you that Never before has this kind of win, this kind of prowess at golf been seen since Tiger Woods in his prime. You'll notice, though, that in most of the media coverage, you'll see how great it was. He got four under par at the Augusta uh, course. Um, but what you won't see is what he did. A couple days ago or a few days ago, last week when he was talking about heading into the finals, he uh, had this beautiful statement praising Jesus Christ. Watch. Yeah, I'm a faithful guy. I believe in in, in a creator. Uh, I believe in Jesus. I think that's what defines me the most is my faith. You know, I believe in one creator and I've been called to come out here, do my best, compete and uh, glorify God. And that's pretty much it. And then upon winning, he gave the glory to God again. Watch this. I've been given a, given a, a gift of this talent and I've, I, I use it for God's glory. Um, that's pretty much it. So this is super beautiful. A lot of people, when they're in their struggles with life, you know, that's when they turn to God. But often when they get to the top, they don't. He did when he got to the top. Let's remember to do that. But you know what? In every single day, in everyday life, we're going to meet people. We're going to see people. And we're going to be able to bring to them Jesus Christ. That's the whole purpose of your life. The real work was done by Christ on the cross. We got to do that work every day to our brothers and sisters. You've got a chance, you've got an opportunity today to affect your wife, to affect your kids, to affect your friends, your colleagues at work. Do it, do it now. Take up the example of Scotty Scheffler. Praise God for his witness. For Life Site News, this is John Henry Weston. May God bless you.